We the only ones, African Americans, that don't have no language. There's a reason why, sister. Everybody else speaks some type of language, but we share a language, which is English, with everybody in the world. So we don't understand what other people saying, but they can understand what we saying. Y'all don't find that strange? I did, until I started studying the word. Deuteronomy, Deuteronomy in Hebrew. Yahuwah brings a nation against you from afar, from the ends of the earth, as swift as the eagle flies, a nation whose language you shall not understand. And then we've been in slavery for how long? According to the word, maybe 400, 500 years. And then they wanted us to keep voting. Like, I don't know, this shit just don't sit right with me. Oh, that's just because that's all fake. I just had a real deep thought. Yeah, our creator said he's gonna start waking people up during end times. It sounds like he just did it. Just watch it. Um, well, it was like a Chinese couple eating some food and they were speaking their language and I couldn't understand nothing they were saying. You'll do something simple like that. Catch your attention. We, we fucked up. Technically, our forefathers did. We just caught in the middle. And we're doing the same things they did. We fucked up. People that's not studying the word is. The government got us so fucked brainwashed. Our creator said that was going to happen in the word too. Deuteronomy. Deuteronomy in Hebrew. 28. Yahuwah sends on you the curse, the confusion, the rebuke in all that you put in your hands to do until you are destroyed and until you perish quickly because of the evil of your doings which you have forsaken me. And we need to wake up. We've been trying to tell people that. Everybody got their own language and should accept us, their own heritage and everything. Again, he told us in Deuteronomy chapter 28 that. Deuteronomy, Deuteronomy in Hebrew, chapter 28, Yahuwah brings you and the sovereign who you appoint over you to a nation which neither you nor your fathers have known. And there you should serve other mighty ones wood and stone. Thus you shall become an astonishment, a proverb, and a mockery among all the peoples to which Yahuwah drives you. I'm getting wrong, we making our black culture, but it ain't how everybody else is. She waking up, she waking up. This shit's strange. Do y'all feel the same way? Let me know.